Hello friends, welcome to the session. In last session, we understand about the map function and in this session, we will learn about filter function which is almost like map function but it have treated different use case. So to demonstrate the filter function, let's take the same array and in new array, what we do is we simply do arr dot filter and it also give us item so it also give us index let's take item and index both and here what we do is we either return true or return false we either return true or return false. Now I return true directly and all the items are rendered as that in array. But if I return here false, then what happened is the array become empty because it filtered the all the items in this array as they are not required. So we should use certain condition to return what to return. So in return, if I say item not equal to zone then see what happened the zone get deleted from the array item item not equal to zone means this is equal to and this will become false right and other will become true so zone get deleted so in like this we can remove certain item from the array and we can also remove certain index from array like if we do index not equal to not equal to 2 let's see 2 so in index 2 what is there let's give it 2, 2 equal to so index 2 is what 0 index 1 index 2 index right so james got removed so what it does is is base it is basically used to remove certain item to filter out certain item from the array and summing up what we can say that map is used to bring change in the array item and filter is used to remove certain array item based on certain condition so this filter is also a higher order array function given by js itself and that's it the use case of filter so in next video we will learn about event handling and outputting dynamic content in the react so thank you for watching